Here you go. Knock yourself out. So let's say you live in a big house and you own some books. I mean, some other fuck nuts might live at the North Pole and they own a lawnmower, but that don't mean nothing. I can keep a secret. I can keep a secret. Just let me go and I won't breathe a word. Scout's on or... It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. Don't get stressed out. Don't get stressed out. People always see value in what they don't understand. They always see value. That's why we went to the moon. Let stupid stuff get in your head and it gets all jumbled and weird. People think you're nuts. Johnny Powell, you look like shit. You were supposed to be the expert. I paid you good money to help me figure things out, and you repaid me by skipping out in the middle of the night? For what? Jackie, I did what I could to help you control the darkness. But being around you was becoming a problem for me. The darkness is so fucking seductive. I could hear it whispering to me whenever I was around you. It was starting to change me. Are you gonna kill me? Is that what this is all about? I let it out, Johnny. Now I don't know if I can control it. You let the darkness back out? Jesus Christ, Jackie, that thing is like a slow suicide. Then help me get it back under control. You don't control the darkness, Jackie. You cower in fucking fear of it, and you pray it goes away. The longer the darkness is active, the more it'll try to confuse you. It'll try to trap you, make you see stuff that, that, that other people can't see. I need your help, so you're back on the payroll until I say you can go. A bunch of assholes just came after my entire operation. And whoever gave them this envelope is connected to the darkness somehow. I need you to figure out who they are and what they know about it. Okay, yeah, yeah, I, uh, I'll do what I can. It's... It'll go a lot faster if you get one of your gorillas to untie me. Please? You can untie him now, Chief. But keep an eye on him for me, would you? Hmm. Wow, that guy really let himself go. I used to think he was pretty smart. Now he looks like something the cat threw up. Hey, hey. Frank and Eddie are back from the club. They're waiting for you with Jimmy in your office. All right. Thanks, Vin. Don't you listen to that voice in your head, Jackie. You fear the darkness like it was the devil himself. Everything it says is a lie. How you holding up, Jackie? I'm all right, Aunt Sarah. How you doing? I have arthritis and two bum knees. Every day is a gift. How do you think I'm doing? You're something else, you know that. And you look like shit, you know that? I'm gonna make you some of that meatloaf you love so much. I'll have it for you in a couple of hours. Nice home-cooked meal is what you need. You're the best. Bet your ass I am. Jackie, you're gonna wanna hear this. That Swifty prick was right. The assholes who hit us are hiding out at the Brimstone. What did you geniuses find out? It was Eddie who heard it. I was otherwise engaged at the time. He was busy snorting coke off a of hooker's ass. Never could multitask. Well, these two chuckleheads are getting their dick spit polished. One of the whores starts running their mouth about the new owners. I had this girl, Camille. She says the place got bought up last month. The new guys took over the top floor. Yeah, but that ain't the best part. Camille says she's seen some weird guy with a limp go in and out of the place. Says he looks like Nosferatu on crack. Who the fuck is Nosferatu? Your grandmother. No idea if this wank job and his crew are still there. But it might be worth checking out. All right, enough talking. I'm headed down there. Whatever you say, Jackie. I think Vinny has a friend who works there. Might want to ask him about her. Hey, Jackie, you fuck up that pool all good or what? Hey, Jack. So, uh, Jimmy told me about the Brimstone Club. Sounds like a real dumpster. You, uh, got a hookup over there? 
Well, uh, you mean uh, me? Well, I, I mean, I'd never go to a cesspool like that, but I, I got a friend who goes there sometimes, who, you know, when it's late at night, when other places are closed. I know a girl there named Venus. Sure, she can help you out. She's a real handful. Two of them, actually. The new owners are real pissy about the door. They don't let nobody bring a gun in. That's fine, though, because you probably want to learn as much as you can before you, you know, do your thing and scare the living shit out of them. Damn right. Okay, then. You ready to get some fucking answers? Take me to this shithole, Vinny. I thought you'd never ask. Let's go. Jackie! Jackie, wait! What? What's the matter? Uh, 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 this envelope. Uh, uh, where did you say you got it again? Off some dead guy that was paid to kill me. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Something wrong, Johnny? Uh, nothing. Um, uh, couldn't be them. Because that'd be really bad. Hey, um, I, 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 I gotta do some more research. Uh, good luck in your killing spree. Me and the boys will take him to the zoo while you're gone. Retards like the zoo. Let's go, Vinny. Atta boy, Jackie. What do you say we go tweak some nipples and see what happens, huh? <laughs> I remember this one time, when it was summer, hot as balls. Jenny and me were on the stoop, with a couple of cones here, trying to cool off. And here comes this fucking kid. You know the type. Asshole all the way. He shoves me over, and takes a seat between the two of us. Jenny, takes one look at him. Dumped her cone right in his lap. <laughs> That's when he pushed her. So I did what I had to do. I curbed the little fuck. Figured a few months eating through a straw would teach him how to talk to a lady. Jenny? Didn't talk to me for a week. Trust me, this... Hey, don't I know you? I don't think so, Chief. I'm sure you'd remember. I gotta frisk you, tough guy. Yes, that's good. Arms to your sides. This is a friendly joint. No trouble. You packing tonight, Hotshot? Who, me? And spoil a party? Yes, he's clean. Add inside. Have a nice evening. Right through this door, pal. I can make all your dreams come true. Come on, Joey! I need a hit! I done what yet. you need is to work a shift. You don't sleep, Joe, for once. Most customers oh, don't yeah. like to sleep in oh, over. Yeah, we'll keep love that bald guy. Why? You didn't mean that Turn around! The action's bad. that way! So why don't you punish me? Hi. You look plenty awake now, don't you? <laughs> Hi there, baby. You looking for a good time? You must be Venus. I'm Jackie, Vinny's friend. Well, any friend of Vinny's is a friend of mine. Why don't you come up to my room? I think I could arrange something special just for you. Follow me, handsome. cameras in these elevators, but we ain't got much time. I stash Vinny's gun in my room. If these new guys find it, they'll kill me. They don't play games, Jackie. These are some messed up fucking people. They all tweaked out and shit. Just promise if anything goes wrong, you won't rat me out. So you gotta get up to the third floor quickly. Are you listening to me? Uh, yeah, yeah. I got it. 
Come on, it's this way. is we go to management and air our concerns. Have you seen this new guy? The hunchback guy? You're gonna ask that fucking abomination for a raise? I figured you could go ask him. You're better at that shit than I am. something for you. They closed off the top two floors. We figured they was just shooting pornos up there. But then, Chantel went to go see that hunchback guy on the third floor. Now we ain't seen her in a month. Here, this is from Vinny. Nice. Now you go find these assholes and make sure you give them one for me. Shoot Quasimodo upside the head and put us all out of his fucking misery. Please, God, save me from all this excitement. Get up to that vent. Right, go need your help here. Close your peepers a tick. Wait, what did you do? Ah, oh, neat little trick, innit? Now you see what I see, don't you? How's the view? Short. Let's get moving. You hear that sound, brothers? It's the cry of the beast, drawing ever closer! The darkness loves us! This, I know! Yeah! Yeah! As it tells yeah. us so. Right. The relic will hold it. Once we have it, the world will be ours. Brother Victor was the one who found it. Was he on the Yes. It I'm was still lost, and I'll ask it myself. <laughs> Sin produces dark essence. Dark essence gives us power. And Sin is profitable. Yeah, pretty sure that's bad. Yeah. Something's not right here.
Brotherhood found me in the dark. Wait a minute. Get closer to him. I want to see what I'm up against. With pleasure! Ooh. Get close enough for you! Fuse box on the wall. Especially this!